What's up guys, it's Chuck from Brady Adventures and today we're talking down blankets. I got this roof nest down blanket a year and a half ago when I got my roof nest and have been using it since then and I love it. And recently Get Out Gear sent me their down puffy blanket that they sell on Amazon and asked me to take a look at it. So what I decided is the best thing to do is to open this up and compare it to my roof nest blanket and let you guys know what I think. We'll have links in the description below to the Get Out Gear poofy down blanket and we'll also put in a link to the roof nest down blanket. The first thing I noticed when I opened up the Get Out Gear blanket was that it's quite a bit smaller than the roof nest blanket. This blanket is a full seven feet long and six feet wide. The Get Out Gear blanket is a little less than seven feet long. I think it's 80 inches instead of 84 inches and it's four and a half feet wide. So it's quite a bit more narrow and the Get Out Gear is 650 down and the roof nest blanket is 750 down so the difference in the size is related to well the roof nest is just a bigger blanket a wider blanket and has a higher fill so that explains the size difference there's also a cost difference the roof nest blanket is 225 dollars which equates to about five dollars and 36 cents per square foot where the get out gear is 70 dollars on amazon and sometimes there's a coupon and that equates to two dollars and 33 cents per square foot so it's more than double the price to get the roof nest blanket the roof nest blanket has this sort of standard string with the slippy locky thing whatever the hell that's called and your blankets just inside of there and actually this can be kind of a pain because it does poof out of there sometimes where the get out gear does have this nice buckle that you can wind up and that's going to keep that blanket nice and tight in there. I really like that. Um, that's a, a nice little addition. Let's pull out the get out gear. Take a look at it. Oh, interesting. Hmm. There's some snaps on either end. I can I guess you can snap it around you. You could probably use this for several different things. I Kind of like that too, that's pretty cool. Check it out. Premium snaps convert your blanket into a poncho to trap in warmth and allow hands free use. That is a pretty cool feature. If you've ever worked with down blankets or down sleeping bags before, then you know if you compress them and they're compressed for a while, they can take a long time to re-expand. I've been messing around with these blankets for a little while and they've lofted up a little bit. They probably need a little bit more time. I don't know the actual amount of down in the blankets, but the roof nest definitely lofts up a little bit more, but the get out gear is not too bad. We just had a few observations, like the stitching on both of these is, you know, it's pretty nice, um, similar quality. Um, the fabric is, the same kind of 20 denier fabric and they're both really nice blankets. Mm -hmm. I think the biggest thing is that this one is quite a bit smaller uh, than this one and I think when you're using those in the field they sort of have different things that they're going to be good at. Right. So what do you think about that one? I think this is definitely good for one person. Um, the snaps are nice so you get all cozy and bundled up mm -hmm. keep it around you when you're sitting in a chair. I think if you're sleeping, it's probably good for one person. Um, if you had two, you could probably snap them together to make a bigger blanket if you needed yeah, to. Yeah, that's really but cool But it's idea. a nice, it's warm, it's lightweight, definitely good for one person. Yeah, and this one is, you know, it only looks a little bit bigger on, when you look at the dimensions, but when you actually get it out, you know, it covers quite a bit more space. Um, when I initially saw the dimensions on this, I was like, oh, it's going to fit the roof nest mattress perfectly. Um, but you pointed out that if there's two people in there, mm -hmm. we're not really going to be able to wrap it around each other and get that full coverage. If you want to have something that's going to cover two people and something like a roof nest, the roof nest blanket is a great option. Um, but uh, at this price point for this thing, I really like your idea of snapping two together. Like you could have two of these and they'd be a little bit more versatile in being able to have two people sit in a chair like you're sitting with one or actually snap them together and use it as a blanket like this. So a couple of these would cost you 140 where this one is 225 So I don't know. I don't think you can go wrong with either of them. I'm really 
pretty impressed with this for the price mm -hmm. compared to how much a lot of down stuff costs. We'll have links in the description below to the Get Out Gear Poofy Down Blanket. And we'll also put in a link to the Roof Nest Down Blanket. The website where you can see all the products from the Get Out Gear company is called shopgogear.com. So check them out too. Hey guys, thanks a lot for watching. If you enjoyed the video, please give us a thumbs up. Hit that subscribe button. Hit the bell for alerts. And let us know if you have any questions or comments about our puffy down blankets or anything else we have going on with our 100 series Land Cruiser. Thanks. If you like this video, please give us a thumbs up and consider subscribing to our channel. And always feel free to leave us any comments or questions that you might have.